Hey everyone, welcome back to TSC Connect. Today we have a workout video that was requested by one of our viewers and they wanted to do a workout using a physio ball or a Swiss ball, essentially one of the large um, exercise balls. And so we put together a scoliosis friendly workout that has all the movements in spinal neutral that will challenge your shoulders, your core and your legs. So please enjoy. Let's start with squats using the ball. Place the ball against a wall or door and stand leaning your lower back against the ball. Anchor your hands on your hips, actively elongating your spine, aligning your pelvis, which is also called the bowl, and your rib cage, which is also called the bell. Lower down into a squat, sinking down to hinge at your hips and ensure your feet are far enough away from the wall to lean against the ball and keep your chest up. Stand back up and repeat this movement, pushing through your heels for 30 seconds. Ready, set, go. Now, lengthen your trunk, maintain your alignment, and bring your feet together for single leg squats. Bring one knee up as high as you can without losing your alignment. Try not to hike your pelvis up. Do a single leg squat for 15 seconds on each side. Ready, set, go. Switch sides in three, two, one. Next is mountain climbers. Place the ball on the floor, pressing up against a wall. Place your hands on the ball, push your chest away from the ball to stabilize your shoulders and find a high plank position. Slowly bring one knee toward the ball, but keep your pelvis, trunk, and legs in a straight line. Alternate sides for 30 seconds. Ready, set, go. Let's do a second round of double leg squats with your back against the ball. Do this for another 30 seconds. Ready, set, go! Find your balance for the second round of single leg squats. Do this for 15 seconds on each side. Ready, set, go. Switch sides in three, two, one. Let's repeat mountain climbers on the ball, this time picking up the pace. Do this for 30 seconds. Ready, set, go.
transition to the floor for double leg bridges. Lie on your back and place your lower legs on the ball. Arms can be on the floor or raised up towards the ceiling. When you feel balanced, tuck your pelvis under and lift your hips up to be in a line with your trunk and legs. Slowly lower to tap your pelvis to the floor, then lift up again. If you feel this in your lower back, try tucking your pelvis a bit more or don't lift up as high. Repeat this for 30 seconds. Ready, set, go. Find your bridge position again. Keep your pelvis tucked and lifted, then roll the ball to bring your heels towards your bum. Straighten your legs to go back to an extended position and then repeat this movement for 30 seconds slowly. Ready, set, go. Now let's combine the last two movements. Tuck your pelvis, lift into a bridge, pull your heels towards your bum while keeping your pelvis lifted then straighten your legs. Tap your pelvis on the floor then repeat the sequence for 30 seconds. Ready, set, go. Let's do a second round of supine double leg bridges for 30 seconds. Move slowly. Ready, set, go. Get ready for a second round of double leg hamstring curls. Do this movement slowly for 30 seconds. Ready, set, go! This is our last exercise for our legs. Let's do a second round combining the bridges and hamstring curls for 30 seconds. Ready, set, go. Next, let's do shoulder push-ups. Roll forward onto the ball as far as you feel comfortable. Position the ball under your thighs for an easier version, or if you want a challenge, position the ball under your shins. 
Place your hands on the floor and keep your head in line with your body. Push your chest away from the floor and then lower back down without arching or rounding your back. Repeat this slowly for 30 seconds. Ready, set, go. Let's do a dead bug using the ball. Lie on your back and clamp the ball between your knees and your hands. Maintaining a neutral spine on the floor, lower the opposite arm and leg without moving the ball. Return to the start position and alternate for 30 seconds. Ready, set, go. Here's another core exercise called rollouts. Start on your knees, then lean on the ball on your elbows. Bring your pelvis down to be in line with your trunk and thighs. Engage your shoulders to lift your body away from the ball. Maintaining your spine alignment, roll your elbows forward and then bring them back in. Repeat this for 30 seconds. Ready, set, go. Cool down, let's do a modified child's pose. Place your hands on the ball and walk your knees back. Keeping your pelvis lifted, reach your sit bones away from your hands and lower your armpits down to be in line with your body. Ensure you don't collapse into an arch and don't tuck under to round your back. Hold this neutral position, breathing slowly for 30 seconds. Ready, set, go. You're all finished. Good job. For other workouts and more, check out TSC Connect. See you next time.